Hi guys, thanks for joining me on the Gilded Bellini. Today I headed down to the sunny South Bay to a brunch spot that all the locals cannot get enough of. For bottomless mimosas, a beachy escape from Hollywood, and an always bustling crowd. Today we're here at the Rockefeller in Manhattan Beach. Brunches uh, have a tendency to be real big, real crazy. The bottomless mimosas, you got amazing breakfast burritos, chicken and waffles. It's uh, it's a fun time. It's why we actually moved over to using open tables so we kind of accommodate larger parties, you know, 21st birthdays, that kind of nature. What do you think the Rockefeller offers that keeps the crowd coming every weekend? I mean, we're more than just a team. We're more of a family here. And I think that really comes out in the service and the way people, you know, come back weekend after weekend after weekend. It usually starts with two, and all of a sudden I'm meeting grandma and grandpa by the end of it. So, you know, it's a South Bay spot with, you know, burgers, beer, and brunch by the beach. I love it. Is your menu seasonal? Do you switch it up, or does it stay the same? So our menu isn't seasonal, but we do always make a concerted effort to kind of turn things over, change things up, see what creativity comes out of the kitchen, really to kind of make it, like I said, a, a team and more of a family experience here. So your name is Alejandro. Correct but they call you Jan. That is correct. How did you get that nickname? Correct. Well, Alejandro has a tendency to be kind of a jarbled mess after a while. It goes from Alejandro to Alejandro. <laughs> and so, you know, three equal parts. I just kicked off the first three and the last three letters and Jan was what was left and stuck ever since. Stuck. Absolutely. <laughs> Next time you're in Manhattan Beach and you're craving a really great brunch, make sure you stop here at the Rockefeller. Plus, who wouldn't want to hit up the best brunch spot in town?